Okay. Um, let me download a game that we can play. This is a game from China, as far as I understand. It costs four dollars. It is already downloaded. All right, let's play this game. Terrible artwork since 2017, great. Uh, I kind of want full screen this, one, one. Okay. I got two out of two. Oops. Wait, what? Let's see. I was just clicking. Wait, why do I have a thinger? It wants the star. Wait, what? Did I get? Oh, the star meant done, I guess. Okay. We didn't care about the triangles. We went through the down, but not the up. Okay, so far we're just going through the down, but not the up. I think this is the number of shapes that are like satisfied, right? Wait, what? Did I get the square and circle wrong? Hold on. Oh, you start at the circle and go to the square. Right? That's weird. Okay. Did I not do this? Wait, we're going through the up. Why can we go through the up now? Because the line is straight? I don't get it. Why can we go through the up? So, okay, 
here, one, four, one, we go through the up. One, three, we go through the down. If we go through the up here, now I don't know if this dotted line is a hint or if it's actually an element that has to be satisfied, but I'm gonna assume it doesn't. It isn't because we have circle, square, and triangle are sort of the three things down here, I guess. But the only thing different between 131 and 141 is that there's no dotted line. Watching you fail. I'm not failing. What are you talking about? Oh my God. Um, so, yeah, so this puzzle, okay, I'm not sure I like this because I'm not sure what I'm supposed to take away from this. Literally, the only difference between 141 and 131 is a dotted line. Oh, that's full screen. Can we actually go bi directionally from these? So the, here we have one, which I assume is the triangle, right? If I do this, one of these is, uh, okay. So here circle and triangle are okay because none of them are crossed in a way they don't like. This, okay, so this is circle, right? I think that's literally a screenshot of the witness cursor. Anyway. So, okay, what? So one three, again, appears to be saying, oh, I messed one up. One three appears to be saying you go through the down. It appears to be saying you always go through the down. But, okay, this line is straight through. This is straight through. That is not. So again, so this, you, okay, you literally have to start on a circle. It's not passed through a circle. It's not going straight through the down. Okay. Maybe there is something else about the relative orientations of things that indicates in the puzzle which one you're supposed to be able to go through. Right? Like here it's downs. Here it's downs. Here the circle is below the square. Here the circle is above the square.
We certainly don't have to go through all the downs because of this guy. Maybe it's plus one, minus one, you have to end with an uneven number. No, because we have literally exactly the same level. Here, one, three, one, you have to go through the down. One, four, one, you have to go through the up. Like, does it have to do with the level number? Maybe. Maybe the middle is a four, so it's even, so we need the ups. Why are people in chat saying false things? You're not helping with the puzzle game by saying false things. Do you think that the game just changed the rule? Like, did they just say now, now it's up, now it's down? No, you would think that, but no, because... Uh, okay, I forgot even what we're doing. Here, okay. That's zero. Wait, I thought we were stopped on a different one. No, but it was that one. Okay. So here, if we only go through ups, we don't succeed. That was a random guess. There are eight ups. There are six downs. Is it that there have to be an even number of ups? No. So that satisfies it. That satisfies it. So whether or not I get this down doesn't matter. That does not. That does not. That does. No, it is, it is consistent. It's just there's a, there's a little bit of a large, large design cliff here where they want me to make a very large jump that they haven't laid the groundwork for. Oh, yeah, I should, I should put the game in the chat. It's, there's, there's no game called understand. So we're playing underhand.
It's just hit all the ups. No, I'm not convinced of that. Because get all ups wasn't the rule before. Although maybe it is now. Why? Why is it get all ups? What is it about these ups that means we have to get them? Seven minute ups. In one four one, does the down matter at all? No. Um, I don't know. I I feel like I don't like what this game is doing right now. But we'll see. So here it's like get all the ups. Except that's not easy, right? We can't get all the ups. I don't think. Well, can we? I don't know. Is there some graph theory thing that says we can't get... Oh, we could do this. Yeah. All right. Okay. So here there are four elements somehow. See, here we don't go through the ups. Is all six fields in 141 a valid solution? I don't believe so. That is, though. Like, the down is kind of irrelevant, I think. That's a solution. That's a solution. All right. I don't know what the fourth... Okay, so in here, maybe the four things are all the symbols, but why are there four here? Are these all just four? I don't, I don't get it. How are there four? Maybe this has two circles and two squares, and they're just on top of each other. I don't know. So why do I not go through the ups now? See, now the ups are like obstacles. Why? Now there's only three. See? What's the deal there? I I feel like I feel like they need to do a little bit here. Further explanation is in order game. I have no idea what I'm doing at this point. 
and I'm just doing stuff. Now it's like you have to go through every square as a rule. I think they're just changing the rule on every level, which is fine, but you need to tell people. Like if I go into this assuming it's a witness like, then I assume that the rules don't change. It seems clear to me that they are now changing the rules, which is fine. But it, it maybe took too long to understand that for sure. Okay. Are these like hints of what the thing is? They're just changing the rules. It's actually the first sentence on the Steam Store page. The Steam Store page is not in the game. Yeah, so there's something about two shapes connecting with a right angle. Wait, except... Wait, what? I thought I just did that. So it doesn't matter. You could start on circle or square in these. But it's about connecting... Like the triangles do not seem to matter. Run rules to go from circle to square? No, because this was circle to square, but this was square to circle. If I go circle to square here, it doesn't work. Oh, well, that's actually a clue. Like, why do I have to go square to circle here and circle to square? This is a right turn. That's a left turn. The both of those work. Like, what? what is wrong? What about the context makes this wrong? About figure frequency? Maybe. Okay. Yeah, I see that. That makes sense. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, five, four. Uh, 
And then three, so we have to go circle star, and then two. Oh, wait. Yeah, five, four, three. And then two, and then one. I'm going to assume I can go re go through the same shape twice. I don't know. Like maybe that's okay. Five, four, three, five, four. Oh, maybe you have to count down the whole time. Three. Okay, let's go one, two, All right? One, two. You can't go to three from here. Maybe it's just you have to. Hmm. Dude, Twitch chat is so annoying. <laughs> One, two, three, okay, let's just go five, four, three, five, four, two, one, I don't know, yeah. So it's like you have to hit all of them in non-decreasing, like, there just needs there just needs to be more flashing out of these. Okay. Oh, whoops. And see that third square there. All right. Easy.
Okay. So this satisfies one of them. This satisfies the other one of them. But that doesn't satisfy both. So connecting these circles in either direction, okay, that was random. Connecting the circles starting at a circle and ending at a, s no, not even, I don't even know. So that satisfies left one. So does that. So does that. So does that. So connecting two circles. And then not connecting two circles. Like connecting two circles and then isolating the other two. This is like the witness thing about things being in isolated groups. So is this. I don't know what this has to do with any of that. Um, but I get that. Okay, so Okay, so that gives me one connecting any two of these connecting different ones doesn't so it's the left one is any two of the same shape, probably, possibly. And so we need to split others of the same. I was hoping that it would be, it has to be in a separate group from its own shape, but that is not the deal. So this is it. So here I can go through a thing as long as I end on the same spot. Okay, that gives me number two, but not number one. So I've split the two ups, and so I have number two. So I need to split the two ups, or just leave two ups. Yeah, that's, eh, so these rules are, eh. Like, I don't, are they changing the rules in the middle of the level? I don't think it's supposed to work that way, but I don't know. Um, all right. So you sort of eliminate things from consideration by going through them on this level. Why didn't that work then? You're, you're right. It is 
seven squares every time. That doesn't seem like a coincidence. I don't know how to do seven. I don't know how to do seven here, except, oh, it's gotta be one of these, right? So the group separation was a red herring, basically. The rule is seven squares start and end on the same shape. The, the separation was just uh, a false pattern. All right. Started a circle, ended a circle. Surrounded a square. Now that's weird. This didn't do any, but oh, that even does one. That does one. So touching a star just gives us a point. Touching a triangle doesn't give us a point. But that doesn't, but that does. We lose the point as soon as we connect the star and the triangle. Okay. So whatever. So So all of one without the other, that gives us no points. So we kind of don't know which one is the target shape. Like, how am I supposed to know which one is the target shape? There, there's two target shapes. Yeah, so here squares are bad. Circles and triangles are good. Squares are good. Circles and triangles are bad. Can I do it this way? No. Triangles are bad. So is it circle and star on even levels? No, because here's an odd level and square is bad. Square is bad, maybe good. Good. I don't know. Circle, star, square. Circle and triangle. Star. No. So we have one square, two circles. But we already did a level where it was like the most versus not the most. Here we have four and three, and we did the four. Here we have two and three, but two is even, right? Four is even, two is even. Uh, here we have four and two. Okay, so I think it's you get everything that has an even number, which would be this. Oh no, because we missed the triangle. So 
I like the idea of the game now. It's just I wish there were more indicator when you start playing of like what you're actually doing because it was a little bit. I assumed I knew what it was and I didn't, and that was confusing. And then I imagine if you didn't assume what it was, but you just didn't know, that might be equally confusing. Okay. Yeah, by the time, so, and, and also in the beginning, like you don't necessarily trust the designer. Now I kind of trust the designer. I kind of don't like, like I feel like some of this stuff could have been done better, but I at least see what the game is and that it's consistent and that it makes sense, um, which is good for designer trust, right? Okay. So this is a new set, right? Did we click on it? Yeah, we clicked on a new thing. So we have no idea what's going on. Um, okay, so maybe it's evens and odds again. I don't know. But so... Well, it doesn't seem to care. Okay. Third light is like So connecting circles is left. Connecting squares is middle. And then like I was going to say the right one is three things, but that's not quite what it is. Oh, it's connecting at least three objects, maybe. Three or more objects where you connect two of each kind. That seems too complicated. Let's see where it goes. Oh, no, because you don't need to connect two here. You connect two squares, but only one circle. Mm, let's see. Now that's interesting. So this only gets us one going this way, but this gets us two. This gets us to the three or more. Is this like path length four or more? That could be path length four. Path length four. Hello, rating people. We are playing a shape game. Yeah, they should just have the about this game in the game. If it's going to be that helpful. We, unfortunately, we're pretty far into the star square circle game. Um, so path length four is lighting up the right hand side. The middle is... Uh, is it the same middle as here, right? The middle here seems to be connecting the square to the circle or the circle to the square. Oh, so now we didn't get the right hand side with path length more than four. Let's see, because we didn't have big enough boards. So path length four gets us it. Five does not. I think it has to be exactly four, which is interesting because that constrains the puzzle a lot. Okay, so I don't know. Connect all the shapes is maybe one of them. Right? I 
Now I gotta get some tea. Teapot. Oh, here it is. Here it is. We got oranges, we got tea, okay. So, path length four, get all the things, star, circle, triangle, square. Oh, there's this. There's five things. How am I supposed to get five things? With a path length of four. Now, there are different. So maybe it's the top four. Right, so we've got a lot of circles, five circles. We've got only one triangle. So the, the triangle is the chump here, right? Maybe it's also in order. Is it in order? Because here I went more and then like, oh yeah, it's in order. Okay, who's there the most? Uh, stars are four. Circles are more than stars. So circle star. Square. Other star. I don't see a way to do that. Maybe it's to make a run of four in order and it's not most to least. So if you can't do five, four, three, two, maybe you can do four, three, two, one, right? Um, star is four. Square is three. Uh, Triangle is two. Wait, is triangle two? No, triangle is one. Where's two? Is there a two? Square is three. Star is four. Wait, are there... So there's one of this and oh no, there's two of these, right? Okay. Two, one. Okay. We can't go two, one. That's not a thing. That is not a thing. Unless we re go through things that already existed. Okay, so here that's no good.
Yeah, I don't remember. Didn't I just do that? Anyway. Um, so this ought to work. Oh no, this won't work. Because these are out of order. Hold on. Four, three, two. What did I do? What was the solution to this one then? Didn't I just do this? I thought I just did this. Level bug? No, I don't think so. I think. Where was this? Now I want to go back and look at the VOD. I thought I just did a thing here. Right up, left up from top row. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> oh, you don't mean directions. Right up, left up, like that. Oh, I see. Um, okay, well, I actually thought I just tried that a minute ago, but maybe I didn't try exactly that. Okay, so there's something about this one. Like, look. This works, however, things that are similar do not work. Why does that solve it? Well, good question. Path length four. It is only, it's going like three, two, one, two. So it's only going through consecutive numbers. Right? Um, but like four, three, two, one doesn't solve it. And only also goes through consecutive numbers, right? But we never had one as high as four. This also doesn't go through consecutive numbers. So there's maybe something about the number of things remaining, right? Or I don't, I don't freaking know. Here we go, one and then two, and there's two left over. <clears throat> two left over. One left over, and it's in the same group with an empty area, and it's ordered somehow. Like, You already start off with the biggest. No, that's not established because of this one. 
You don't start off with biggest here. We started off with the biggest of the ones that are in the solution, but I don't know what that means. And 272, can you go up? No. Neither can we do that. That's pretty weird. Yeah, so there's three stars here. There's three here. But this one, we start with square, and that only has two. Right? We went this way. No. Oh, never mind. Oh, so that's three as well. That's three. So you start at the one with three. And then what? Path length four. Okay, so one of the points is probably start at the one with three. That's the left hand. As long as you start at the one with three, you get the left hand point. Path length four is the right hand point. Start at three, path length four. What's the middle one? Connect. Two of another shape. So the circle is irrelevant here. Or is it just this Tetris piece shape? Because that keeps happening, right? Mm-hmm. That's very suspicious. So we start with three. So actually, this is a good puzzle. We start with three. Path length four. Wait. Path length four would be redundant with Tetris piece shape. You know what I'm saying? But these are all the same frickin' L. Oh, but this one, oh, that works. Okay. You can't cover another one of your starting symbol, maybe, right? No, you can. You can't cover all of your starting symbol. Oh, wait, no, you just maybe just have to end on a shape. No. Oh, because that's not. Okay, hold on. Yeah, so there's. Okay. So never mind the L shape. It's start with start in the three, path length four, and something else. Yeah, it doesn't it wants us to go to the squares in this one.
so we have to go to the square. Start with three, go to the square. Here we don't go to the square, but we do go to a thing with two. <laughs> There's two squares, there's two squares, there's two squares. Start with three, end with two, path length four. All right, so start with three, which is square, end with two, which is uh, this guy's path length four. Seems hard, oh. All right, GG's. All right. So we left Brittany alone. Okay, so the, the rule is leave Brittany alone. Maybe. We're still leaving Brittany alone. Trying to figure out what the fourth one is. Okay, so. Yeah, maybe this is saying shortest path. It's quite possible. So it's the shortest path between the particular... No, it's not anything to do with shortest path. Okay, so this is a different number than this one. This is seven. This is 11. Is it like prime number of steps? Three, five, seven, Nine, two, ten, 
four. Yeah, it's prime number of steps. Okay. Three, six, nine, eleven, twenty-two. Okay, the problem is we need an odd number. Oh, tw 20, this is 25, so we need 27. Is that 27? Hold on. No, 27 is not prime. 29. Twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Okay. Six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Twenty-six. Twenty-three. Wait, why didn't you give me the star? Solved it. Oh, because we didn't, I messed up one in the middle. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, we didn't do two eight. Seven Eleven hidden sponsorship. Maybe it's seven to thirteen minute abs hidden sponsorship. That's the real reason why eight minute abs did not win. Okay, start a triangle, start halfway to triangle. Okay. We're just gonna keep going. Find some theories. Okay, so that's left hand, which might be star to star. No, it's not, not anything that simple.
I feel like... Okay, that's interesting. So one square does it. So it's like Okay, here, the left dot is always going. Oh, wait, I thought it wasn't. Wait, what? Oh, it's there that it doesn't. So left dot is like eliminate all of the shape that you start on, sort of, except if you start on nothing, then that counts as not constraining you. But if you start on nothing, you can't land on something. No, it's eliminate all of the shape that you pass through at any point. Um, it's eliminate all of the shape that you pass through at any point is the left dot. The right dot is an interesting question. Like, are triangles special? Like, why, why was I allowed to end there? End next to where you started. No, that, yeah. So, no, because if it was end next to where you started, this would pass. Yeah, it could be leave only one type of shape, right? It could be, no, but that's interesting that that, see that doesn't do this, but that does. Wow. 
What if I go like this? That does too. So it could be more than one shape. Now here it says leave the most numerous, I guess. But that's not, maybe it's leave circles, right? That's the star puzzle. I don't know. Leave three shapes left over, maybe? No, because that wasn't here. Oh, leave an equal number of shapes to however many you canceled. This is the cancel culture game. Um, so if I eat, I could eat six and leave four, right? Eat five and leave five. Mm-hmm, okay. So, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh boy. So we could go seven plus six is 13. Plus, well, okay, what's seven, six, five, four, three, two, one? is 28, right? I kind of want to add that to be paranoid. But assuming that's 28, we need to add to 14, which would be 7, 6, and 1, right? GG's. That was a good puzzle. Um, so we're sort of keeping them into a group with themselves. That's straight out of the witness. Oh, whoops. Straight out of the witness, bro. All right, a little too easy. I just did that because I was sure it's like it can't be the same rule. Okay. Um, triangles, triangles, squares and circles. Like, I want to keep the squares and circles combined, but I can't do it. I can't do it. Okay. Uh, I 
So the triangles want to be just in separate groups. Doesn't matter. And then these don't really want to be in separate groups. Yeah, I mean, it's sort of what I would expect. Okay, so let's just say, let's say this is straight out of the witness as well, and it's this. Yeah. So the triangles just don't want to be with each other, but they could be with the other things. Okay, so now it's tricky because we don't have triangles, right? So one of these shapes is probably the triangle. I'm going to say it's the square. I don't remember which one was left and which one was right here. Yeah, one shape type per region could be the generalization of this is true. Or one, one of any particular doodad per region. So that means I do this, right? Yeah. Well, and then, so that means, I mean, this is not really solvable then. GG's. Like, okay, so the problem is you need to cut these and you need to cut these, right? Oh, I guess you do that. Okay. Okay. Maybe this is some shortest path action. Okay, so we're having trouble. Okay, the right hand one, maybe it's like you have to occupy the middle squares, right? No. You have to go left to right across the middle squares. Yeah, it's all the middle squares, all right. Oh, can I do this? No. Uh, can I go right to left? Yes.
I don't know how to satisfy the constraints and go left to right. Oh. You have to cover all middle squares, but not necessarily. I thought I tried some versions of this, though, and it didn't work. So like this didn't work. But this. Wait, what? Maybe it's just you need to have three, but that's not right. Five. Okay, interesting. Is it more than half your path length has to be across the middle squares? That could be. Yeah, yeah. More than half your path length has to be across the middle squares. But then I don't know why that doesn't work. Is it just some of it has to be not in the middle? But that was all in the middle. Free demo. The game's four dollars, guys. You could afford it. You could afford four dollars. succeed in video games, you need to eat a lot of licorice. Okay, maybe it's not across the middle. Maybe it's more horizontal than vertical. And this one might be like start and end at circles. Okay, let's say. Hmm. What? More horizontal than vertical, and by the way, you're passing through a shape. That seems complicated. Middle one. Hmm. 
is end in a square, I guess. I mean, I feel like it's, so far it's like start at a circle, end in a square, more horizontal than vertical. That's two. I mean, how do corners count? I don't know, but this is three sideways and one, whereas this is, there's no horizontal. Mm. Maybe it's just three horizontals. Okay, yeah, one, two, three, three full horizontal squares, except that doesn't explain this. So it's something about more horizontal than other things. comment on the readability of changing rules for each puzzle group. Would it be better for each unique rule group to have a different look? I maybe, maybe not. It depends. I might do that just to give people more variety because you know what, how nice it is what you're looking at is part of what you're doing when you're playing a game, you know. Wait, did I not? I thought I did this one. Yeah. Okay, so this works. That also works. That does not work. It has two verticals and four corners. Uh, dude, I don't even know. Okay, that shatters every theory that I have now. What is even going on? Maybe it is the number of turns? So that's two turns, but we had two turns here but they were in opposite directions. Like total rotation here is zero. Total rotation there is zero.
Yeah, it does seem like it wants... It wants different regions. So that might be why I was tricked into thinking straight line was because what it really is is these. So let's try that. So we need to make two regions starting in a circle and ending in a square. All right, that was cool. New rule. New rule starring Bill Maher. Four in the background. And not, maybe it's four with, let's try to jump ahead. Every triangle has four spaces, right? Not quite. This has every triangle with four spaces. Maybe they do have to be separated. That it's you're not gonna be able to give them four spaces though. Oh. Okay, wait, let's go back here. Starting at a star, ending in a star gives us two things. So does that. Okay, don't touch the triangle is like the middle one. Yeah, so don't touch the triangle. Go through the stars, but not having to pass through them. And then maybe the third one is something about How much space is in each? Yeah, maybe that's the trick is we have to like, hmm, it doesn't seem possible. It doesn't seem possible to leave each triangle with one. Yeah, it could be another like split, split all the triangles, but we already did that. So it seems unlikely. And I don't know that it's possible to split all the triangles here. Doesn't, well, well. No, I don't think it's possible to split all the triangles. Going around the outside, around the outside. So maybe it's don't split all the triangles. It's they all have to be together.
Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to split it. So as long as I don't split it, we're okay. Okay, so triangles have to be in a group is the right hand one. Don't touch the triangles is the left and the middle is go through the stars. I don't know. Something like that. GG's. Okay. There's four now. Okay, this is all don't do various things. Okay. So here, again, we're sort of splitting the squares, but I feel like it's like... So it's start and end. Start and end on the same shape as this one, probably. No, because we don't get it there. Start and end on a circle. Start and end on a circle. Split the squares, maybe. Probably not. Who even knows? I don't know what the other two are. I, that only seemed like two rules to me. There were four dots, but I just did start and end on the circles. Maybe that's two. And split the squares, that's three. Maybe don't touch the squares was four. I don't know. Okay. Boom. Be a cool dude is rule four. Maybe. Maybe that was rule four.
Okay. Next. Eating orange is rule four. So these were like two circles, two circles, but all of a sudden we need three circles. Okay, interesting. This does not light up dot number four, but this does. This does light up dot number two, but this doesn't. Do they change your ad levels? I do not know. My brain is starting to get tired. My, my thinking brain my imagination brain Okay, what do we know? Okay, we're splitting the squares into pairs. Pairs of squares, maybe. So pairs of squares is like number four. Seemingly. Seemingly. But then why do we get number four here, but not there. It's not pairs of squares, guys. It is not pairs of squares. Especially not, there's no way to do pairs of squares here. Not more than two squares? No, because look, Fourth dot does not light up here. Fourth dot does light up there. Fourth dot does not light up here. Fourth dot does light up there. Okay. So like, what's the deal? Pairs of squares. Is there another way that I could pair of square this besides the symmetric one? I kind of don't think so. Not an end on a circle, but maybe you don't have to end on a circle. Hmm. And so then we know there's also a circle rule that we don't know. Let 
maybe it's just like the number of un Let's see what's what's up with that this is the same one that was lit or not lit from pairs of squares guys so like clearly what does this have to do with pairs of squares It doesn't seem to have anything to do with squares. I agree. But then it does. So here we don't get dot four. Here we don't get dot four. That's interesting. Is it like just, just one background group? Are we playing the just one background group game? We may be. But this isn't just one background group. Odd number of background groups. Odd number of background groups. One, two, three. No. It's five. No. W one. None. Or one. One background group. No. Yes. Like, what's the difference between these two? Uh, going next to all the squares or not, except no, because that doesn't do it. Here we're going next to all the squares. Here we're going next to all the squares and it doesn't work. Yeah, so it's... Instead of two squares, yeah, okay. Instead of two squares per background, or instead of squares need to be isolated, it's there have to be two squares per area, which actually means there has to be two of a particular shape per area, which is the point of this one, right? Except that doesn't do it. Because we also seem to need to start and end on circles, in which case, oh, it's okay. They don't have to be the same shape. Why didn't I try that? I don't know. Okay. So okay. What is rule three? Is it don't go on squares? Yeah, may maybe so. So rule three. So we want to start and end and leave an even number. There we go. And don't go on squares. Got it. Okay. Oh, whoops, that one. Sorry. 
Oh, don't go on squares though. So we have to do that. We have to do that. And we have to do that. Really? Really? We started and ended on circles. We left two things per background group. Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, well, we didn't start and end on circles this time. Oh, we can make the background group bigger. So we could do this. Okay. That's a cool puzzle. Cool puzzle. Are these clues? I guess these are clues. Or are these just example puzzles from... Five! Guys, I might be too tired to do five right now. I might have to switch to another game for a bit. So it's maybe circle to square. It's maybe go in a straight line, but you can't go in a straight line here. It's maybe don't touch the triangle, don't cross the streams. This could be start, circle, end, square, right? Yeah, end, square gives me number two. Start, circle gives me number one. So start, circle, end, square, that's easy to remember. Start, circle, end, square. What's five? So start circle, end square. Like what? This is giving us something. Maybe this is like don't cross triangle. But then what's that? Oh, only one triangle in an area. Start circle end square, don't cross triangle, only one triangle in an area. Uh, I don't know, anything. Path length equal to longest dimension of grid. No, because we don't. Hmm. Have I tried room to grow? No, I have no idea what that is. So number five, elusive rule five, is about the room of twisty passages. It's not path length. It's, is it total curvature? No. Is it every, you turn every square? No, because of these. Mm, 
Yeah, is it each triangle has equal territory? That could be. That could be. For this one, it wouldn't matter then. Every area has a triangle. Elusive rule number five. Oh, they have to, hmm. There's like a limit on the number of squares. Oh, it's like every shape has to be the same size. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. Wow. What a nice puzzle. Start circle N square three area. Okay. So what is this? Three, eight by nine. So we want three eight by threes, which is 24s. We want three 24s. which are six by four. And this is going to be the hard one to do. So I don't, I don't freaking know. And I think the filled in area is going to take care of itself here, right? So three, seven, 14, 17. Fourteen. 22, 23, 24. So if I end on the square, I'm good there. Wait, we can't. Wait, what? Oh, my path is too long. Okay. Interesting. My path is too long. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, one. No. Yeah, I'm I'm already I've already used up my whole path if I do this shenanigan. So we have to do I don't know honestly. Something like this. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have four more squares to play with if I do this, if I go this way. Actually, no, not even. Hold on. Can't do that. There, four more squares to play with, which I can't really do anything to do with. And on the left, it's already way too big. It's already 27. It's already 33, right? And... If I have four squares to play with, I can't do more than subtract four. So you can't go this way. But if I go the other way, like I don't, okay, I think I have to barely, hmm. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, fourteen, twenty-two. So I have two squares to play with, which is jack squat. 
and I need to give him four more squares. I can give him two more squares and be at 24 if I do this, right? So I could go like this. This is a good puzzle. I like this. Am I so? 7, 14, 18, 20. Oh, wait. This is 22, right? Hold on. 8, 11, 14. No, this is 24. This is my limit. I think. Yeah. So the problem is I need to give this guy more space and I can't. Not if I go this way. Oh, or I could cut straight across here. I could give it on this side and then eat a piece out. Yeah. Okay. So here he has 20. Now he has 25. Five, 10, 15, 20, 24. 24 is the highest number, forget about it. All right, seven. Okay, well, just two, three, four, five, six, seven. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. Forget about it. Forget about it. 24, it's the highest number. Okay. We can, will, and should blow up the moon. Have I played Snakebird? Yeah, Snakebird's okay. It's a shame they did Snakebird Primer, which is silly. It's a bad game. But Snake, original Snakebird is pretty good. It's just not that approachable. It's like too... It, like original Snakebird, I think everybody thinks it's too hard, but it's not too hard. It just doesn't have enough traction. For how hard it is. Oh man. All right. So this is three, six, nine, twelve by three by eight. Twelve by eight, which means we need four uh twelve by two pieces, four twenty fours. Our minimum path length is 12, 14. So we have 10 squares to play with. Okay. That's not a lot. So I think we're going to need to go like down. We're going to need to do some shit like this, right? I don't know. That's 24 on the left. 25 on the right. So we like do that. Forget about it.
Forget about it. All right. My brain might be tired pretty soon. It might be time to play a more mindless game. So, if there's multiple shapes, one of them outnumbers the other, or something. Let's make some levels. So, this is symmetric, so that's good. So here, maybe it's don't go through a shape ever is the left. Don't go through any shape. Don't go through any shape. Unequal number of at least one circle and or no, it, hmm, at least one shape and not an equal number of shapes. Something like that. Oh, weird. Okay. No. So this works. This doesn't. So this is like, middle is like more squares than circles. But how, that's like, mm, there's no, there's not more squares than circles here. Maybe it's just more of one shape than another, but that doesn't go here. So it literally is, if there are squares, more squares than circles. But that's not true here. Right? So it's like middle one. Middle one not true, middle one is true. Middle one not true. Maybe it's like there's exactly two squares, right? Maybe it's just not at all that. It's like the background regions have unequal numbers of things. The background regions have unequal numbers of things. All right. You dig? or not. Ooh. 
what do I think of Tarkov? Um, dude, I played a lot of Tarkov a while back. Um, I think the game could be made tremendously better with some simple changes that I don't know what their problem is and why they don't do it. <laughs> like, it's a really interesting game. All they have to do is make a few more changes and it'll be really good. Like they're, yeah. What kind of changes? Um, time to kill is way, way, way too low in Tarkov and way too, it leads to uninteresting combat, all right? So I agree with what a lot of the high-end streamers say, they're all correct. Like look, um, armor should matter actually, ammo, it's cool to have high pen ammo, just it should be incredibly rare and maybe even not sellable on the flea market or like, I mean, maybe you just sell it to traders or something, right? So like in Tarkov, wouldn't it be great if finding, like say you're on shoreline or something and you find 10 rounds of M995, like that should be approximately equal to a GPU in rarity, right? Because A, and you shouldn't be able to get it from traders or anything, right? Because then A, you would <laughs> uh, treat it as a lot more precious, right? First of all, you could make a lot more money off it. It would give you a lot more e different, exciting things to find, right? Right now, the, there's a few really exciting things to find in the game, like GPU or LEDX or whatever, and they're usually just to sell, right? What if it was exciting to find something because you could use it, right? And then you've got, maybe you've got 20 or 30 995s that you saved up, right? Um, and you want to ration them in combat now. So all this complexity that's built into the game about reloading, you know how you can select which mag to reload off? I forget how you do it, but like you hold R or something and you pick it. Like maybe you've got your high pen mag and your regular mag and like, you switch to the high pen if you see somebody really armored and then you really, you just tap instead of fire hosing it because you really want to save those shots, right? Um, the way to do that is just, yeah, scarcity. Like, did, way too much stuff comes from traders. Even, um, like I would make like level four armor is the highest you can get from traders you might be able to get five or six once or twice as quest rewards, but that's it, right? Um, and then you have to find them in raid. Um, but once you find them in raid, they're like really good to have, right? Just all sorts of stuff like that. I don't know. It, uh, it boggles the mind. Like, Shrink the frickin' head hitbox a little bit. <laughs> um, I don't know. It's just not fun. It's not fun to go as a player who's playing solo and trying to get geared up to go out and get head eyes by a team of four. Like, that's just not interesting. Also, the game is not fun until you get the open market thing. I mean, sort of, but also the flea market kind of ruins the game because it means like to build your hideout and whatever, you can just buy stuff. You shouldn't be able to just buy stuff to build your hideout either. You should have like, you should have to know what map to go to and what area of that map to go get hose to build your ventilation system, right? Like give people more directed stuff to do. Recoil should be massively increased. Also true. Yes. Recoil should be massively increased. Um, well, also though, like part of that is dynamic. Like if you get like a default scav AK, a 762 scav AK with no stock on it, it's got a lot of recoil, right? So the problem is all the attachments are too good, really. Um, 
you shouldn't be able to make something into a laser beam. You should be able to make it better. You shouldn't be able to make it into a laser beam. Player skill, like character skill is too ridiculous. Like, I guess I'm fine with some of the character skill dimensions, like strength and speed or whatever, but it's too much. Like a beginning character is too lame. Um, again, it's just, you're just going to get your face stepped on by people who've, who are level 50. Um, oh, the fact that people who are level 50 can hear like five times as far, and that's an exaggeration, but they can hear much further than you. That's super unfair. Just take that out. Take that out. Like the wearing, wearing active ear pro versus not, I guess that's fine. But like take out that people who have cat asked more hours in the game can hear, have a larger hearing radius. That is bullshit. You didn't know that? Yes. Perception skill in Tarkov means you can hear at a farther radius. It's absurd. It's the sound is so important in that game. It's so important. All right, I'm going to refill my tea and then we'll keep trying to think about the squares here. I mean, at the same time, I will say, like, Tarkov is really interesting, though. It's, like, interesting in a way that a lot of games, like, a lot, most games with significant budgets are too scared to be interesting, right? And Tarkov isn't too scared to be interesting, so that's cool. It's just, it would be so easy to make it better. I don't know, I don't understand. I don't understand what they're doing. Um, So that's the thing is like, I, I really, I think Tarkov is an interesting game of all the shooters that are out right now. I probably would ideally want to play that, but I don't actually want to play it because I just don't want to go get my face stepped on by a team of four fully geared level 50 players time after time. Like it's, you know, that's another thing I would do. Have some zones that you either can't go into with more than a certain amount of gear or you can't go into once you pass a certain level or both, right? I mean, that would involve making more maps, I guess, but just do it, man. Just knuckle down and do it. <laughs> like, there needs to be a place where you can go and just not get annihilated. <laughs> have I seen Veritas' video on Tarkov Realism Fallacy? No, I have not. There needs to be systemic created low level gameplay. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> there does. And, you know, if they want to keep in one taps in the game because they're super sick and they feel good to do, that's fine. But again, with like scarcity of high pen ammo and all that stuff, like they would feel better. Like, oh, my God, I shot an M993 or whatever. I actually haven't played since they added 993, but I assume that's good. I haven't seen it this wipe when I watch people play on Twitch. Like I have watched people play Tarkov on Twitch for like 50 hours and I simply do not want to play the game, right? That's how much unfun it is. Like they would have way more players if they just freaking fixed it. 
No, the problem isn't the server. Wipes don't fix the problem because even after a wipe, the people who play a ton of the game will just play a ton of it again really fast. They will always be ahead of you. You need a way to play without getting stepped on by people who are always ahead of you. Like it's less bad after a wipe because at least people don't have like million dollar or million ruble loadouts every time. But like it's, I mean, even, even if gear, <laughs> even if gear was exactly equal for everybody, you would still have a su substantial disadvantage to experienced players because they just know the game so much better. It's a complicated game. They're just better at playing it, right? And you're already probably still 1v4ing all the time. So like, I don't know, man. It's, it's a mess. It's a mess. They, they need to, they, like, I know they're focusing on Streets of Tarkov, and that's, I guess that's fine. But like, m more maps isn't going to make the game better. More maps is new. That's cool. You have to fix the gameplay at this point. You just have to. It's just too absurd. Okay. If they do something to reduce the absurd TTK, I will play Tarkov again, but till then I'm just not going to play it. Like, and then especially the fact that it takes so damn long to load into a level and then to load back into the menu. <laughs> like, it's very easy to spend half your time loading into menus, right? Because you just dropped in, you got killed, you load back. Do I play any Quake? No, I mean, Quake style games are too boring. They were fine when they came out, but they're just not, there's not enough to them. Optimization is horrendous. Well, it's better than it used to be. They're improving it. Okay, middle. I'm not getting middle here. I am getting middle here. I am getting middle here. Is middle like something about the number of squares? Three, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Doesn't seem to be about the number of squares. Okay. Start adjacent to a circle. No. Start between two circles. No. Start between two shapes. Start between two shapes. Yeah. No, that didn't give me middle right there. End between two shapes. What the hell, dude? What is it? Um, have I tried Valheim? No, it just looks too boring. Life's too short to play Valheim. I mean, unless there's something interesting about it that I haven't seen, but like, is there, can someone tell me what's interesting about Valheim? Yeah, so it could be circle versus square. It could be one circle per background region. Right. Let's see if we get middle. Yes. Oh. Oh, I accidentally did one, two, three. Okay. So it's unequal, unequal numbers plus one circle each. Wait. Huh. 
hold on. <laughs> Wait. So we did this. So unequal numbers plus one circle each. Oh wait, that's not one circle each. Yeah. Unequal numbers. One, two, 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 three. That's not gonna work. Uh, unequal numbers. One, four, two. Yeah, okay, they don't have to be consecutive. Unequal numbers, one circle each. Yuck. Can I? And and don't don't touch a symbol. All right. I don't know. Five. Four. Two, one. Oh no, that's five. Dang it, can't go in and out there. Um, five, two, I can't, I just can't go in this corner and come back out. Five, four, no. Okay. Two. Five. Dang it. Let's just start here, get this over with. So we have a one. We have a f five. We have a, ugh. We have a problem down here. We have a two, two, two. We have a, we have a six, we have a one and a three. Bing. B three question mark. Did I watch the start? Oh, day nine's here. What's up? Is labeled as underhand. Yeah, they don't have understand on Twitch, so my policy is when that happens, I just pick the closest name and confuse people. But yeah, Tarkov is obviously silly. They have 27 million ammos and you don't ever want to use most of them. Like, make it so that you want to use PSO GZH under some circumstances. Like, why is that even in there otherwise? Okay. Valheim just looks like another way to waste time with friends. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. No. No, no, no. Yes. Well, let's see. Hmm. 
Okay, so what can we derive from this? We have three spaces in the background. That's the commonality, or a commonality. We have only squares in the background. Dang it. Dang it. But I don't know, we didn't determine if we can have extra regions. Okay, so there's no way that we're going to be able to separate these two squares. So it might be three per square, right? So we want 12, 12 background spaces. Oh, actually, no, we can separate. I'm being a silly. I'm being a silly. Oh, uh, four. I think, I think that means I have to, hmm, I have to probably start here. Hmm. Almost. Almost. See, I have to like leave the grid is the problem. Probably. Like I can't, I can't go in and out here and I kind of can't. Yeah, see, I, you can't go in and, oh, I could do that actually. Why am I, why am I imposing limiting beliefs on myself? Okay, let's see if they have to be discontiguous, right? So there, does that work? No. So they do probably have to be separated. This is very close though. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Problem if I do this is... Mm. Yeah, we kind of need to go between these. We need to go here. Probably. Not strictly. We could like start here and end here, but that's probably not going to go well. Now, see, we can't do both of these like the problem is these both can't be L shapes, right? So if one of them is an L shape, the other one has, so one of them has to be horizontal three basically is what we're saying. There's no way around it. Let's say it's this bottom one. Then what? Then we have this problem of this guy. So what if it's the top one? Well, we can't do that. GG's. That's a funny trick right there. I almost didn't think of it. This game is on Steam. It is called Understand. We are pretty far through it, but not done. Okay, don't touch the stars. Equal number in each region. Two in each region. Just directly out of the witness. Two of any particular shape in each region. That is... You know, whoa, we're in negative worlds. We're pushing block. It's a Sokoban game. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, so I don't know what the rules here are. Start on a shape and end on a shape. No, start on a circle, end on another shape. Um, I don't know. Oops. So what is mysterious number five? Is it, is it another like equal opportunity employer? Hmm. It's at least not all equal this time, but it's like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm.
Oh no, the stars are pushable. What? Okay, I don't understand that. Oh, equal number, not equal space. Okay. Oh, wait. Are these pushables? Wait. Why isn't that? Is it like only one shape per space? You know, with the rule switching all the time, I get confused. It's probably only one shape per space, right? Maybe no empty regions. It's not equal number of background squares, so maybe it's no empty, no empty regions. I don't really know how to do that. Can I push two? Yeah. Yeah. No empty regions. All right. Oh boy. What? Oh, we need to make a region. No? No. Yeah, maybe maybe because there are no shapes we can't have any regions, right? That could be it. Easier said than done. Like, see, the problem is, oh, I could do this. Mm, see, there's this off by one problem. Does that mean we have to push it? An odd, an even number of times. Wait. Beep. 
See, as soon as I do this, I'm kind of hosed. Well, yeah, see, unless I push that guy, I don't know what to do. But if I do push that guy, I'm still off by one. So it's like I need to be able to push him and then push him again later. Push the circle into your starting location. I don't think you can do that unless you can. Whoops. Oh, I didn't. Okay. See, we don't get the start on a circle points. I think this is start on circle. This is end on square. Right. had it I had something and then I accidentally right clicked what did I do what did I do that oh no cuz there dang it bro That wasn't on your start point? What do you mean? What are you talking about? Can I like push it? Oh. Oh, you see this trick? You see this trick? Okay, you push the circle onto your starting point. 
I get it. I get it. I mean, I'm still not doing it right, but... Um, So like, that doesn't quite do it because I didn't end on the square, but you see my point. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's a cool puzzle. That's a cool puzzle. I like it. I dig it. Okay. That is thinking with portals. Now you're thinking with portals. Okay. What even are the rules that we're talking about? Two of the same in any zone, maybe. There is nine. So you have to push one onto another. I bet that's the trick. I bet that's the trick. Boom. No. Hmm. Can I? No. Oh, wait, no, there's eight. Because there's a hole in the middle. Duh. Duh. I understand about holes in shapes, guys. Okay. Hmm. This is tricky. Okay, so I need to do something like this no 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 oh because we have an empty region down here Huh. I was like, what, why have thou forsaken, forsaken me? And the answer was this. Okay, I'm going to quit while we're ahead. That was cool. We're going to come back to this game later. Um... I feel like there's a lot to go because, well, I don't exactly know, but it seems like there would be levels up here and stuff. Um, so we will do that in a bit. In the meantime, we're going to play, this was Understand on Steam. I have one achievement. Oh, it just hasn't reloaded, I guess. How do I? Why does it think I only have one achievement? I did these chapters. 44% of players have it, but I don't. Now we know how many chapters there are. Didn't do one six and one nine. Hmm. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, I didn't. You're right. Where's my mouse cursor? Um. I did all of three. I did all of. Oh, I didn't do two ten. All right, let's do these real fast. These are gonna be easy. Hold on. What? Okay, we just got star to star. With a circle outside, I guess.
Maybe you'd have to leave all the circles in peace. Start on a star, end on a star, one circle per region, don't touch a circle, right? Makes sense. Oh, on, one and only one shape per region is a circle. Or... Yeah, because this didn't work. I don't see how I'm supposed to do this, though. Well, oh, this is the final boss puzzle already. Start on a star, end on a star, one circle per region. I don't know, guys. My brain's tired. Circle to square. Fill everything. Not circle to square. So this could be starter in a circle. Whoops. Oh, no, it's not about starting anywhere. F fill every square, maybe. There's literally no fill every square solution. Oh, fill all shape squares. not passing through the same shape consecutively twice. GG's. Look at all these level ones. How is this not the same? It's not. <coughs> okay, we started here, we went there. That worked, that didn't work. Start circle, end square. Start circle, end square. But there's only two rules. So it can't just be that. Or can it? Is this the red herring level? No.
lol. Lol. You make joke. Okay, this one we didn't get. Here's this one. So it might just be start at a star, end at a star, fill all shapes but circles. Because we haven't actually had an opportunity to put more than one circle. Start at a star, end at a star. Don't go into a circle, fill all shapes. But hmm, there's really no way to do that. Yeah, don't go through a circle, fill all shapes but circles. So this is like fill all shapes but circles, right? This is don't go through a circle, right? So if I do this, we have filled all shapes but circles and not gone through a circle, right? I just don't see how to, am I being dumb? How do I do all four of these? How do I start at a star, end at a star, Fill all shapes but circles and not go through a circle. Maybe it's not all but circles. No, no. Oh, fill all squares. And don't go through a circle. GG's. Okay. I don't want to do another Sokoban. Maybe I do. This isn't Sokoban, I see. It's a different mystery rule. All right. Start a circle, end at a square. Don't touch a triangle. So what's this one? Start a circle, end at a square, don't touch a triangle. Um, and then something about the stars. One star per region? Touch the triangles. And 
It's not one star per region. So getting rid of any of these stars satisfies three. But two of them doesn't. Okay, so one star, one star inside your path. One star inside your path. So maybe it's not don't touch triangles. Maybe it's like Oh dude, I can go out here. What? That's is that a secret? That's a secret of this level. What? Are you kidding me? That's a troll. That's a troll. Hey, do you know the guys who are making this game at all? Johnson? I mean, they're mainland China, right? So, but like, I don't, I don't see that many. I don't see that many games from the region here. So it's interesting. This is the first time you saw the game? Okay. Yeah, it's a game called Understand on Steam, and I know it because on the same on that same trip from a couple years ago, um, was it the same trip? No, it actually wasn't. Uh, but I went um, I went to Beijing and I did some stuff, and uh, you met some guys there, and um, one of them emails me. Or but two of them email me once in a while. Um, yeah. Okay. So, don't touch a triangle. Yeah, they've got to be. This has got to be the troll, right? Yeah, that's a troll. That is such a troll. Okay. What did I do in Beijing? There was a. Um, there was like a. It's called uh, Game Cores is the group, and they have this like G Cores. It's kind of a trade show more than, I think they do a little bit of conferency stuff, but it's mostly a consumer trade show in China, like which running a consumer trade show in mainland China is, uh, it, let's just say it's interesting. <laughs> it's interesting. <laughs> or what do you call It's not trade show. It's what do you call it? It's like PAX, right? Um, it's kind of like PAX, but uh, much smaller. Or the, the event, the event in Beijing was a lot smaller than PAX, but I, they do other stuff. They do one in Shanghai and convention, I guess. I, yeah, convention, gamer convention. Was that the talk with the live translation? Probably. We play related. Um, I don't remember any We Play sponsorships or anything like that. Although I might not have known if they were if they were in Chinese, I wouldn't have been able to read it. But I assume I would have noticed a logo or something. Um, I don't know. There was like a lot of indie stuff there. Um, there was like hang out and talk to the voice actors from a couple of big games. I don't know. Anyway, one of the 
of them emailed me and said, hey, this is a game made by someone I know that's kind of related to The Witness, and it's cool. I, I've enjoyed playing it. I'm going to play it some more. Um, it's just my brain is tired right now of doing the Schmancy puzzles. So we're going to play Space Game now. Um... Okay, we got another achievement. I feel like I've achieved something. So when did this, when did this come out? Understand, October 30, 2020. So it's been out for a little while. Yeah, so this stuff down here should be in the game. <laughs> I mean, I figured it out, but it should be in the game. Like the desire to be language independent is good. You need to somehow explain these things more.